star Quincy Promise, who was convicted in absentia last month by an Amsterdam court of involvement in cocaine smuggling and sentenced to six years in prison, has reportedly been arrested by authorities in Dubai at the request of Dutch prosecutors, who will seek his extradition. Prosecutors did not confirm Promise's name, but said in a statement, judgment that a 32-year-old man who lives in Moscow was arrested in Dubai. Promise, 32, lives in the Russian capital, where he plays for Spartak Moscow. Dutch prosecutors rarely release the names of suspects in criminal cases. The arrest was made based on a red notice issued by the Netherlands. Netherlands will request the extradition of the man, the Amsterdam Public Prosecution Office said. A red notice is a global request, based on an arrest warrant or court order, for law enforcement authorities to locate and provisionally arrest a person pending extradition, surrender, or similar legal action, prosecutors said. The arrested man was reportedly staying in luxury in Dubai according to various media reports. However, he has been taken into custody thanks to the efforts of the authorities in both countries, they added. At this time, it is not possible to provide additional information to avoid disruption of the ongoing investigation. Spartak recently played friendly matches in the United Arab Emirates. Promise hasn't appeared in recent games. Promise, who scored seven goals in 50 international matches for the Netherlands before legal issues derailed his international career, was convicted last month of complicity in cocaine smuggling and sentenced in his absence to six years in prison. Amsterdam District Court ruled that Promise was involved in the import and export of hundreds of kilograms pounds of cocaine in 2020. It was not his first conviction. Last year, Promise was found guilty of stabbing his cousin in the leg and was sentenced to 18 months in prison. Promise, a former player for Ajax and Sevilla, lives in Moscow and did not appear at his trial in the Dutch capital. His lawyers told judges he denied the allegations.